Hi, I'm Jacob Beals and this is my show and this is my second video in one day. Uh, most of the time I don't make two videos in one day, but I just watched Taylor Swift's new music video for Look At What You Made Me Do. It was kind of hyped up on uh, really everywhere the other day when the song came out and uh, the video was announced that it was coming out uh, like around the time of the VMAs and I thought I should check it out because I made a video about Taylor Swift the other day and this will be like a little companion video I suppose to go along with it but I made a list here right on my homework so I'm going to put on my glasses so I can read the list sorry for the glare but I, I need to read the list because I have a terrible memory but I, here's what stuck out to me in the video first of all there was that Taylor Swift zombie right at the beginning I, I, I don't know what that was about it was a little crazy but it, and it scared me a little bit I mean it it wasn't the Taylor we're used to seeing I, I suppose it's because like the old Taylor's dead you know that line and later on the song kind of a dumb line but you know symbolism and then she's in a bathtub and it's filled with diamonds and later on there's snakes and i thought well she's making a reference to indiana jones but i don't think she was i think it has something to do with i don't know death or medusa or something i i don't know why snakes are in it probably not because indiana jones that's why i would put snakes in a music video but this is her video not mine so i, I it's not up to me and then there's a golden car crash not a car crash into gold but a car that is golden that crashes and that's one other thing that stuck out of me. Then she's in like a bird cage at one point, and uh, then, then she she's like has a cat like mask on. And they're like at that point, I was like, man, there are so many references to animals in this music video. I was like, this this should be on like the Animal Planet or something. But 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 then um, one thing that really stuck out to me is like she really shows off her wardrobe once again in this music video. Remember when she made Shake It Off the music video for that? She must have something about like first singles off her albums releasing, like having the first video like show off her wardrobe because this one did it again. I mean, she changes her clothes like so many times and she's in so many different settings and it it was wild. I mean, some of them were really happy, some of them were really sad. It was it was different, a really kind of like different music video. I don't know. Uh, and then uh, at the end, there's all these old Taylor Swifts climbing up to the new Taylor Swift, like old uh, Taylor Swifts from past music videos. Um, and they're all like trying to get at her, or attack her or something. I don't know what they're trying to do, but the new Taylor Swift is like above all of them. It, it, it's crazy. And they're all like zombies almost like trying to get her. It's like the walking dead. Uh, but and then at the very end, uh, later on after that, she lifts motorcycles. That was another thing that stuck out to me. I was like, wow. She, she's like really must have been lifting weights since her last album. I don't know what happened, but that was pretty amazing. But anyway, at the end, after the music stops, all her uh, like uh, past Taylor Swift's are talking to each other. I thought that was kind of funny. It, it was different. It was interesting. Uh, but I like this vi that this video had some lightheartedness to it. And it wasn't like all dark. I was kind of worried since she's going for like this really different vibe. It was just going to be this dark and gloomy video. But it had some comedy and it's some dark comedy. But it, it wasn't all dark and gloomy. You know what I mean? Even at the beginning, it looked like it was going to be. But it's an interesting video. I don't think it's my favorite Taylor Swift video. The song actually, I think, is just all right. But it's starting to grow on me a little more every time I hear it. It gets caught in my head a little bit more each time. But uh, not a bad video. Uh, but if you guys haven't seen it, I think it's worth checking out. I, I don't see myself rewatching it a bunch of times like I have with other videos from her and other artists. But I, I think it's all right. It's definitely got a really good production value and there's definitely some really creative things going on in there like like i said my favorite thing was the taylor swift's cameos but i thought that was funny but other than that this video i think it's decent like i said we're checking out and there's my second video in one day a little quick review for you but i hope you're all doing really well and uh i'm i better get back to some homework because <laughs> I, I sometimes i get making videos and i get all excited and i really should be doing my homework but anyway back to homework and I'll be seeing you all soon. Bye.